Wow. This is a long forgotten cemetery. That's insane. There's just tiny little gravestones. We're gonna see if I can do some channeling up here. We're nuts. What lives in these woods? What the fear itself? That's gray fur. Yeah, that's gray fur. That's wiry gray fur. Coyote? Yeah. Something killed, smell it? Yeah. Something killed a coyote back here. Yeah. And, huh. All right, well. That's. That's just with the story we heard. That's concerning. Yeah. All right, we're gonna have to switch to night stuff soon. All right. All right. See if it does it again. Do you hear that? Stop talking. Or limbs breaking or something. Like clacking. Yeah. All right, let's see how this comes out. It's it's not quite dark enough yet for night vision, but we're hearing like a real loud clacking sound of limbs being broken, and we're just hearing like. What is that? see where that sound's coming from. There's just like a wall of forest next to us.
looking for the best route right now. All right, we gotta do some bushwhacking. Are you ready? There's gotta be a better way. Nope, there's not. Only the hard way. Only the hard way for Hellbent Holler. Are you gonna be able to get through this? I'm gonna try. It's gonna kill you. Oh, what's up? Um, it's it's all holly through here and thick pine. Wait, there's more holly after this? Oh yeah, there's lots. All right, I'm already getting ripped up. Let's go. I'm going headlamp. Um, just because I need my hand free, I'm gonna try to uh, bust through for us. All right. Should have brought a machete. You want my knife? Uh, yeah, actually. You think this is bad? We gotta come back like in the dark though. Yeah. Way thicker. Yeah. It's gonna be easy to get turned around and you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. We're getting there. Right, We're on. taking game trails, like real yeah, game trails. Oh, Jesus. This is so good. Watch your eyes. Oh yeah, I'm trying to break these for you as much as I can. Oh. I actually really did. I heard a noise up here. What did you hear? Oh. Small gravestones are pretty much everywhere right there. Yeah. That one's sharp. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is a long forgotten cemetery. Look how grown up it is over here. The access road to it has been shut down from a washout for a long time. This is an old, old mountain cemetery. It was maintained years ago. Years ago. But... These walls. Come check these out. Yeah, yeah. Man, 
and the forest is definitely taking us back over. Yeah. There's these stone walls like everywhere back through here. Let me take it off nice shot real quick and we can kind of get an idea of what you're looking at here. Salt stone walls are everywhere back in here. They form these little squares that I'm assuming people of prominence used to be buried in. This is insane. So there's just tiny little gravestones hidden amongst all the trees that are coming up. We got what's it? What do you got? What do you got? Could just be natural fall. But very odd. Very odd. <laughs> All right. Move the way. So this is the old unpaved dirt road that goes up to this old cemetery. This is a cemetery from the mid 1800s. Um, the first time we came to the cemetery, it seems like people were coming up here and doing a little maintenance and taking care of it. But this time, none whatsoever. It is completely overgrown and it has just gone back to the wild at this point. So this road has actually washed out. So nobody has access to this cemetery and has had access for a long time. We actually had to hike several miles um, from way over there and then hike straight through the woods to get up here to access this cemetery. Otherwise, you would have to take this gravel road um, miles and miles and miles and miles, probably about 20 miles. But this gravel road is washed out down here, so nobody has access to this. What's that? Mm -hmm. okay. All right, we've brought a bunch of our ghost tech out here because we figured what better way to explore and investigate an abandoned mountain cemetery than try to make contact with the people that are here. So today we brought with us our EMF. Now that's gonna go on, if, that's gonna go off if there's any kind of EMF spike. We're gonna have that set, that reads temperature as well. We also have our tri-field meter, we're gonna have that running. And our newest piece of tech that we have, the PSB7 Pro Spirit Box. This is like the Cadillac of Spirit Boxes. This is one of our first times actually deploying it in the field. So I'm really excited to use it. And I think we're gonna get a little weird with it. And I think we're gonna try an Estes session. Um, for an Estes session, I'm going to blindfold myself so I can't see anything. I'm going to put on noise canceling headphones, connect those to the spirit box. And Joe is just gonna ask me questions and I will just say whatever responses come through on the spirit box. Now I'm not gonna be able to see Joe, so I can't read his lips and I'm not gonna be able to hear him because of the noise canceling headphones. And we're gonna see if like a scream before the wind started up there. Yeah. Could be weird, all right. We're gonna see if I can do some channeling up here. So uh, we're gonna try some possession session kind of stuff. So um, yeah, let's try to see if I can channel anybody or anything, because you never know. All right. 
Are you nervous about doing this? Well, I mean, it's a mountain cemetery that hasn't been visited in probably years. Do you think whoever is about ten miles from the vehicle? Yeah. Um, Do you think whoever's up here, if there's anyone up here, is lonely? Well, I mean, it's that, but then we've been hearing screams in the woods around us for the past little while, so there's yeah. an added level of just Weirdness. tension going on. So we've had experiences up here before. Um, we've been up to the cemetery a couple of times. And we've had experiences up here before, so I figured this would be a great place to try to experiment and test out some of this new equipment that we've got going. Um, do you want to run the psionics while we're doing this? In the sky above us? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think we should. Cool. All right. All right, I've got this stuff set up. I'm not going to load in until we get that set up. So we're going to set up the psionics because we've got a new little experiment we want to try. Not only am I going to be in this cemetery in the middle of the night channeling whoever or whatever may be out here, we're also going to set up the psionics pro on the sky above us. So as I'm channeling down below, we're going to see what's above. As above, so below. And if there is anything that shows up in the sky. This is something that we've thought about and we've talked about a little bit and we kind of want to test it out for the first time tonight here on this mountaintop in this cemetery. We want to see if there's something going on in the sky when we're trying to commune with the dead. Now we've got a backup battery source for this. I don't think we're going to need it given the how long the batteries last on this, but we'll try it. If we need to hook it up to a backup battery source, we will. Hearing stuff in the distance. Yeah, so. Much. All right. So, will you be monitoring that on your phone? I'm going to set it up on my phone and then I'm going to not really mess with it. view of the night sky above us. It's pretty good. That was weird. Everything went off my back. Your backpack just fell. Yeah. Okay. That uh, was bizarre. That's very bizarre. Everything just went off and your backpack just tumbled over. Yeah. At the exact same moment. And it's going off still. Look, look, you're getting like 20s. I'm rolling on the Sonics. That was very weird. Uh, it's still going off. Yeah. And then it stopped. Just completely went dead. Okay. This might be weird. This might get weird, very weird, you know? Yeah. All right, uh, I'm rolling above us right now to see if we catch any light anomalies in the sky. While setting up for the channeling session, a little visitor decides to check out our Psionics Pro. This cute moment is short-lived, however, when he darts away from the area. Our camera completely malfunctions, and we begin hearing strange sounds in the distance. We just had a camera failure. I don't know if what we just recorded is gonna be caught or not. 
we were going to set up for an SD session. We caught something strange off to the side on thermal and we're hearing weird screams from one side and weird howls from another. So we're aborting the SD session and we're going to try to move towards some of these sounds. Yeah. take that road? I want you to get with your thermal and start scanning over here to the where my flashlight's at. I hear something big. Uh, I mean, we don't have any idea what, what that was. But down here, I didn't see anything on the thermal. We don't hear it anymore. I wonder if us starting to do that process of setting up the Estes session, setting up all that stuff. I wonder if that kind of kicked something off. I don't know. Um, right, well, we can try the Estes session, but I don't want anything else out. We're okay, we'll with just song. do that. We'll no just... psionics, no tri-field, no nothing. That's fine, so, that's okay. fine. Because we're kind of out here in the middle of no nowhere, on top of the mountain. We're in the middle of it. We're kind of like sitting ducks. So that's fine. Let's give it a try and see if anything else happens or see if it works, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Real quick, I'm gonna turn this off. Night view. And just show you kind of where we're at with the visible light. There's tombstones all around us. Forest all around us. It's just the very top of this hill. The forest is encroaching over here. But we're literally just in a little cleared spot on top of this mountain. And so we're kind of in a fishbowl here. Yeah. What did you hear? <laughs> yeah, it's all around us right now. It's difficult to even set up. I'm just gonna have to leave the camera running. That's fine, let it run. And then if uh, if the footage is not usable, at least we've got the audio. Yeah. I'm not blindfolding, I'm just gonna have my back to you. Or I'm gonna be looking this way. I can't see you anyway because of the light, but I'm not going blindfolded. That's just not happening. So we'll just do this as a modified. It's too dangerous.
We're nuts. All right, are you ready? Yeah. All right. You ready? Yeah. I'm going in. All right. What is in the woods around us? Can you tell me what these things are that live in these woods? Impressive. Are they alive? Are they supernatural? Are they flesh and blood? What are they? You would know. Something big over here. What is that moving in the woods next to me right now? Seven. What are these creatures? What are these entities? Denial. Are these woods haunted? You know. Are the people that have gone missing near this area somehow tied to the entities in these woods? What will they? Wall. Are we in danger here? Of course. Missed. Tom. What entities are in these woods? Here. What is here? Scream in the distance. What is here? Am I speaking with the entities in the forest or am I speaking with the dead who are in the cemetery? Soon. What is soon? Forces. I'm speaking with the forces then, or that are in these woods? It's starting. Just got extremely cold. Um, extremely cold. You can't go. Why can't we go? Why can't we go? Singing or something in the woods. This is You'll insane. see. This is insane. Glory is weird.
what are in these woods? What entities are in these woods? What creatures are in these woods? Open your eyes. What will I see if I open my eyes? Evidence? Evidence of what? Evidence of what? Evidence of what? Hey! Answer me. Evidence of what? Confess. It doesn't sound like an owl. Go back. Go back where? Stop. It was a very abrupt, like, stop right there. Stop what? You'll learn. What are we going to learn? You're speaking in riddles. What will we learn? Scanning behind us on the thermal wall. Believe. Believe what? One more time, what lives in these woods? What a... The fear itself? Okay. The fear itself lives in these woods, okay. Are we in danger on this mountaintop? Are we in danger here? Is something going to try and stop us from leaving these woods? Do you have a name? No shame. That rhymed, I don't know what that means. But... Can you tell me about the people who have gone missing near here? Were you involved with that? I'll just scream off to my left.
Are you still there? Did you leave? I'm not getting anything else. It's just scanning through. Go ahead and pull them out. Can you hear me? You can. Just me, just me, just me. What? I grabbed that because I didn't want you to get started. Oh my drop, God. Drop the equipment, that's why I did that. I was gonna touch you and then okay. I'm like, she's gonna shock and the equipment's gonna drop. Oh, okay, no, sorry. There are screams all around us in these woods right now. Are you serious? Okay. Yes, all I'm gonna turn this off, I'm gonna okay. turn this off. Yeah, this is difficult to do with just two of us out here doing this. That's why I wanted to Listen, try it you out. Got the fear itself. Yeah, the fear itself. What does that mean? I asked what lived in these woods, I think. And oh, it's Jesus. The fear itself. What, what do you got? What do you got? What do you got? There's something over there. Over where? Take your thermal. I don't, Take your I don't thermal. have it. Right here. Take your thermal. Dose box. Give it to me. We'll set that down. Did you not hear that? We were talking. Anything? No, I don't see anything. Listen, there's, there's been... At one point you said something about seven. I'm hearing stuff from all different directions, but I'm hearing screams and what sounded like, almost like, I don't want to say children singing, but like young singing, like young voices, like singing back down in this direction. What? I think we need to move in that direction. All right. So. All right, let's, let's pack this up. All right. We, uh, yeah, I just wanted to experiment with the, the spirit box thing to see if we could do it, but just two of us out here well, on this hilltop. Like this. this is about as extreme a situation as you can get. We already heard howling, we saw something on the And thermal. then we did this. Heard screaming, <laughs> we did this, and I'm trying to, I'm scanning around with the thermal while you did that. Okay. So I've been all right. looking in all these directions. Um, all right, let me pack this up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, if you'll just give me a second to do it. 